So as, as I uh, get the honor and privilege of just being able to talk to you about this amazing class just for a couple minutes, the word that I kept coming back to for this class was leaders. They're a group of leaders. And in, in youth group, uh, we talk a lot about this uh, being leaders. We talk a lot about what it looks like to start the way. Right? God wants to move in our church, wants to move in our community, wants to move in the world. And I believe, I may be biased, I don't know, but I believe that he wants to do it not just through adults, but through the next generation as well. So we talk all the time about how the wave starts in the student section. You ever go to a college sporting event, it's not, it's not the adults that are starting the wave, it's not the adults that get rowdy first. It's the students, and I think God gives us that picture to show us how he can use young people today in his church, in the community, and throughout the world. And, and ladies and gentlemen, these young people have started the way. These young people have been used by God, mightily, not just in their schools, in their sports, but also here, if that video doesn't make you want to get signed up for a small group, you need to go have a one-on-one -on -one with Ron. Like, it's all about community. It's all about doing this life, not isolated, but together. And so you guys already started a wave just by what you guys have shown in your legacy here. So I am so proud of you guys. I'm so proud of this class. Parents and family, nothing but pride should be coming from that section. You guys have done an incredible job with these students. And we are so excited to see what God has for them in the future because the wave is gonna continue, whether they're going to college or whatever your next steps are, the wave continues. God still wants to use you guys. So I'm gonna have uh, Ron, come up. Oh, he's right there. I'm going to have Ron uh, pray with you guys as we commission this class of 2023. Great. I'm going to have everybody stand up. Uh, this is always a special time uh, for our church and follow hard after Jesus. So let's pray. Father, we thank you. We thank you for this group of students. We thank you, Father, for just the way that this group has demonstrated their love for you, their commitment to you, their desire to follow hard after you. We thank you, Father, for a new generation, next generation, gone through some hard days, gone through COVID, and, uh, and come through that, and then ha had to respond to all the things going on uh, in a crazy world. And I pray, Father, that, uh, that you would continue to give them the strength that they need to, to stand with you, even if they're the only ones standing in their place of work, in their dorm room, wherever they are. I pray, Father, that you would just infill them with your spirit in such a way that they would be a generation that brings true revival to our country, true revival to the church, and I pray, Father, that in these years, uh, some going to military, some going to, to college, some going into the workforce, I pray, Father, that, that they, would, they would go into each place realizing that they are ambassador for Jesus Christ. And I pray, Lord, that you would use them in a mighty, mighty way. I thank you for the parents standing. Uh, I know, I know it's a challenging time. It is hard uh, sometimes as parents. Uh, to be at this at this threshold and i pray father that you would be with each parent help them give them the give them the, the strength they need uh, give them the courage they need um, uh, uh, be with their hearts as as they send their kids off but i pray father that uh, that you would help each parent to be a, a cheerleader for you in the lives of their kids we thank you so much uh, for these students we thank you lord for what they have done and we thank you for what they're going to do. We, can't, we cannot wait to hear how you use this generation in a way that, that, uh, that changes lives around them. Because we know you transform lives and you use people often to do that. So we commit them to you. We give them to you. We commission them, Lord, to go out 
to their colleges and places of work and be the ambassadors for Christ that you have called them to be. And we pray in Jesus' name. Everybody say, Amen. 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 Let's give these guys.